All right, y'all. Uh, let's go ahead and I guess meet Tom Tom to Mark Take a Mark Takamara. Oh, not say his name. But I fairly think I am close. There we go. Go on my way. All right. Oh shit. All right, we're gonna go. Oh my goodness. One. Yeah. I really gotta drive that far. It shouldn't be that far. Yeah, no, it's not. No down there halfway there. So this is better. I don't, I don't know what we're gonna be doing. So I don't know. I just I'm, I get very bored with driving. I like action, I like shooting people and all this other stuff. So it does involve this. It involve that. Then it's serious problem. It should though. This game has a lot of action and a lot of killing, so yeah. Do some easy shape. Gosh. Come on, drive, goddamn. Fuck. Keep it going. I fuck with the hairstyles. I wonder if you could change your hair. I don't think so. It would be nice though. All right, where the fuck is it at? Ah, oh, shit. I'll check later. What is it? Oh, it's a car. Like, I give a fuck right now. I don't care. I might do some shit. I hope I kill somebody. At least I want to snipe somebody. Take somebody off of him. Move my way. Back up. Why is this so far? Oh my god. We're driving farther away from it. It should be that way. Uh -oh. I should have fast traveled. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. This shit's taking forever. And my game crashed. Ah. All right, y'all, we're here. So what happened was my game crashed, and all I did was just fast travel. I said, yeah, I'm not doing all that drive again. So, I do yeah. not understand. We're here. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, it sir. It would run, but... Oh, perfect timing. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some Don't information on my own. Do you know who most wished to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? His murderer. The irony makes me sick. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. 
I have had an idea. Look to the sky. I can't see the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. It's possible, even with implants. And how you aim to manage that? While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Lots of ways to skin this particular cat, you know. Gonna need... I know what you need. It is taken care of. I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. I should ask where you got it, but you already told me. You already told me. So. Anything, let me upgrade. I got like three upgrades. Yeah, I'd rather up on tactical. To take control of the float is one thing, tactical, tactical. but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, getting more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. Alright. Anybody here? No? Uh, where the heck do I go? Where are you? How you go down there? Oh, never mind. Ladder. Way more stuff. Now yeah, let's go. And done. Systems ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that. Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Saka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flat line up. He's not on his A-game, sure. 
Even without implants, he could decommission us easily. Where's that come from? Ever seen him in action? No, just no. From the way he walks, look in his eye. We'll come back to this later. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One, we break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half, we hack Hanako-sama's float. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so... Things even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. What do you Got do? enough on my plate as it is. I'll let you handle that. So I shall. So what do we do? We just wait? Louder! Louder! I have decided to double the amount of our the flesh. active Night City security forces. President Myers has he eliminated the last obstacle between force. himself and the complete power. Of the NUSN they surrendered it to him. Tell me then, what do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside. All of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Why'd Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could've kept the son on a short leash. Arasaka-sama was a strong and disciplined man. The strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu? For his daughter. When Yorinobu fought his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Feels like that's about to change. Long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events, Conscience could also come into play, assuming she's got one. We must reach her first. Time for some reconnaissance. Wait for my call. Call Mr. Hands. Is that a main mission or a side? I've never heard of no man named Mr. Hands. Alright, let's call him. Shaking. Need to make contact with the Voodoo Boy's chief if you can swing it. All right, all right. Straight to heavy business. Hmm. Now, that'd be Maman Brigitte. Be tough getting a word into her. You really don't do any biz with them? Not with the chefs, chefins, priests, and whatnot. All got dirigible-sized egos. Won't talk to lowly me. But if you insist, I can ask around, try to set something up. I'll just need some details first. Uh, got something they want. Truly? Want to sell something to the BDBs? Trust me, they don't want it, they don't need it. They're isolated, insulated, they got their own contracts, tech, networks. But, have it your way. Okay, I'll see what I can do and get back to you. 